fucked, boys. Oh, he's just like not even following me. Okay, that was so weird. Too bad I'm on my last life. Oh shit, son. <laughs> okay. I probably should not try again, but I'm going to, I guess. Damn, the last level takes so long. And it takes so long to even get to the last level, man. Okay. Dun 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 da 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 How many times am I gonna see this intestinal track, man? Yo, Gordea, what's up? Yeah, that was a PB, though. Dude, <laughs> Oshino and Gordea, y'all might appreciate- Well, I'm sure others will appreciate this, too, but... Y'all are maybe the names that come to mind, but... I don't know if y'all followed that guy Tim Stamper on Twitter. Um... He's like a... I don't know if he's like an ex-rare executive or something. He definitely, like, was, like, working for Rare and Nintendos in the 90s, though. And he's been, like... He's been tweeting occasionally, like... Oh my god, my thumb fell off the deep... Okay, reset. He's been tweeting some, like, extremely rare, like kind of miscellaneous Nintendo and like rare things and rare as in the company, but also the adjective. Um, but yeah, he, the other day he tweeted out some kind of like some sort of like dev prototype of some like conquer prototype for N64 that like no one has Tim Stamper. He's tweet. He's been tweeting out like a bunch of like shit. That's like, <laughs> Honestly, kind of rude, I think, for him to tweet, because it's, like, shit that if any person had a hold of it, it'd be, like, holy grail type things. Like, extremely rare and, like, sought after stuff. Yeah. The other day he posted some tweet of, like, of, I want to say, uh, like, another N64 prototype game or something. And, um, that no one has. And with it, he had, like, he had, like, five sealed copies of, like, Ocarina of Time or something. <laughs> like, you know, original N64 Ocarina of Time, just sealed. Tanny Sup. Yes. Three, well... Yeah, basically three dog. Thank you for the, for the good luck, though, Tanny, and for the blessies. You've not seen him before, Gordea. I don't know if he's tweeted stuff about uh, like NES stuff, but I would imagine it's very possible because apparently he's like a very old school rare developer, and like that puts him in like a particularly like kind of cool position because Rare and Nintendo used to be like super close. You could almost say that, like, Rare games were, like, first-party games in a sense. And so that also then means that, like, he probably had, like... Or he could possibly have, like... Like, Nintendo things. Like, prototype Nintendo things. Too. Exactly. <laughs> Oshino. <laughs> 
And it's not even really fair to call it rare and obscure, it's beyond that. <laughs> like, never released, no one has it. Um, never played by anyone. Like, not even, like, I don't even know if that Conquer game was even playable at, like, E3. Like, even in, like, you know, demo, like, press form. Yeah, I'm definitely curious. I haven't seen, like, I honestly have, like, barely been following that guy for long at all. But I'm definitely curious if there's, like, potential other, like, NES, like, SNES, <clears throat> like, rare games. Okay. Well, uh, no, no, you're, you're right, Tanny. Well, most, well, okay, so to explain a little bit further, the Conquer game, at least, I'm talking about here. I don't know if there's other games. It, okay, if I'm specifically talking about the con the Conquer game, which just to simplify the conversation, maybe we should just say that just the Conquer game here. That is a known game that was announced, like you know, decades ago, 1996 or some shit. And I want to say there might have at one point been like a promotional video at E3 of the game, and that's it. Oh, no, 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 yeah, I don't think there's anything wrong with posting it, yeah. I mean, my only thing would be... It's just that it's like... Must be nice. <laughs> that That's the only... I don't I don't think it's bad, I mean, I think it's sick. I, I would hope for that he would post it and share it. But, uh... The only thing I think that's rude is like... The fact that no one else... It, not, it's something that he's like very publicly broadcasting that he has that like no one could possibly have. Oh no no yeah he has not as far as I'm aware he has not posted it so it is it is only bait. It's like baiting slash teasing. That's that's why I was saying it's kind of rude. <laughs> so yes, this is jealousy. Okay, not that I personally like have. I don't really care about the games that I've seen, but, but, okay, but what I do care about is, I, I have not cared about the games that he has shown specifically, but, however, the fact that he would have such a ridiculously, like, rare thing tells me that he probably has other things, too, um, that are pretty dope, I would bet. I fucking missed it. Oh, and I, okay, cool, man. You know, I don't know, I mean, this is probably a little bit of an interesting conversation, I, I, my mind is not made up, I would, you know, for sure, but I don't know if I could blame people for being upset to see such a thing, and then like, it's, it's completely inaccessible, like it might as well not even exist, but this person, you know, has it. But yeah, and that's like especially, like, assume, for example, he maybe has like some prototype versions or something, or maybe some like weird revisions of like, oh my god, I'm getting destroyed here. Say he maybe has some like prototypes or weird revisions of like Goldeneye. Um, that's probably not something I would like care a ton about nowadays, but like, you know, of course when I was younger and like loved Goldeneye a bit more. Um... And I mean, regardless, Goldeneye's still like a landmark game, so... I mean, r r my opinion has nothing... It has no importance on the discussion. Like, my opinion of Goldeneye or whatever, but... Those are clearly, like, classic, very important games. Ha, ah, this playthrough's sucking. I died way too much there.
and actually, Gordea, he, I, I'm pretty, I'm pretty certain now that you mention it, um, Tim Stamper might actually have a build of the Space World demo or whatever, or something like either Ocarina of Time or something else. I, I'm fairly certain he has actually shown that. Okay, yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> so like. Yes. Okay, so, right. I mean... <laughs> I would say, if I could rewind time, I would hope that he would just dump it and not tell anyone. But now that he has shown that he has it, <laughs> it would be a little bit suspicious if he were to decide to dump it. <laughs> so... Yeah, we're just never gonna get... I wonder if doing that fixes the camera for player two on this level. This playthrough is sucking, by the way, y'all. I'm doing real bad. We are, uh, we're getting destroyed. I almost feel like I should just, just go to bed, because that's how badly I'm getting destroyed here. Uh, I am, yes. I've already used all the warps. There's no more warps, unfortunately. <laughs> uh, but the, but yes, I did, um, I wasn't just, like, immediately using warps. I wanted to, like, hopefully master the level before using a warp. And I, I've beaten... I mean, every level we're put, or deathless. No. Well, except for the Klinger Winger boss. And, you know, the level after that, too, of course. Because that's the level I'm on. I know, Gordia. <laughs> Isn't that funny? That he had something that would have, like, changed the scope of that whole project. Well, at least I got the one up. Okay, I just was doing nothing, man. Oh, I'm so lucky.
Okay. I don't know. I just died my ass off on that tower level, though. <laughs> I actually died so much at the beginning of the level. <sighs> okay. But yeah, Shino, let me know if you, uh, or Gordea, let me know if y'all see any more cool content from that guy. really like to have those games dumped. That'd be pretty sweet. And like, I used to love Rare games. Like, I mean, I think every single game they made from for like the N64 was like extremely good. They made so many good games for N64 and SNES and NES. I guess their NES track record's a bit weirder, though. It's probably not quite as renowned. But right now I am playing a, rare, a game made by them for NES. trying to fight that fish, but I had no chance. I'm getting destroyed this playthrough, y'all. Holy shit. sucks too because normally that okay so that fish I'd say like one times out of 20 does it even ever hit me at all um, and or I always do the same thing I just swim right past it but we got some weird shit today I guess I should just go to bed. This is this playthrough's not really worth it. I've died way too much. What's up, JRP? RIP. <laughs> That's good, though.
Oh, the duck, the duck, uh... The way the duck killed me there, yeah. Luckily, that death is not is usually not too big of a deal, because you should be basically getting a free one up there. But, uh... It is still kind of a scam. This fish. Please! Okay. That's pretty bad, because now I'm dead if this shark touches me. Does anyone know how to jump out of water in this game? Oh my god. Well, that was pretty bad. <laughs> um, this is a uh, not good playthrough at the moment. I like desperately need to do this deathless. Rat jam. up, so I was dead. I was like guaranteed death there. Oh, I'm probably dead again here too. I need to wait for it. Okay. Oh. With the assist. This is probably the worst I've ever done versus this rat. I might live. Oh, I'm dead now. Damn. Ah, this is so bad. I was getting a bit greedy with the hits. Very possible this playthrough is dead in the water here, because I might not be able to beat the Klinger Ringer boss. Oh, 
from the last one. My last one was the best I'd ever done. This is definitely a good bit worse than that. It's a miracle I didn't get shocked there. Okay. <laughs> Okay, there's something weird about this boss where it's like, it is occasionally like, you can't really hit it sometimes. Um, oh, that's bad. That's just an insta-death. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I have, I'm sure it will happen, but I have yet to ever lose Klinger Winger with, with the SNES controller. Well, this attempt here is basically just a waste of time, because I have no lives left. So let's just not die. <laughs> I don't know about this then. Yeah, they're all just scams. I kind of like how the, the character design in this game, the creatures slash characters, whatever, they all, they kind of feel like they have a cute vibe. 
while also being like horrifying. Which I think is kind of neat. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it, it honestly is like a cute horror. That's like actually how I would put it. And I think that... And I think part of that is almost like how you personally like resolve it, sort of. Like... Turbo Tunnel, like... You could, you could think of it as like an alien world, or it's like intestines. Or it's like brains. It's really, really weird. Oh my god. One pixel short. I can't believe you're still awake, showing. I can't believe any of y'all are still awake, holy shit. Zany, and that's messed up, man. Well, I'm getting. Oh my god, grab, please! be crazy with no lives left. Just made breakfast? Holy shit. I absolutely thought I was dead. Alright y'all, here we go. I want my platform to be so good to make Zanian proud. Okay, JK. He's on me already! It's on the right! <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay. Oh, I thought I was dead. I was like, wait. I'm just, I'm speedrunning game overs.
Oh, you s what the fuck? Oh my god. Okay. That guy spaced me out hard. Oh, PB refrigerator. Let's let's roll. That's, I could have died just now for what I did. Oh, and I could have died for that too. <laughs> oh shit. I could have died there too. Mr. Cloud. Okay, I don't know. Half my emojis, I guess, are just not rendering or something, or not loading. I did not remove it. So I don't know what's going on with that. Oh, there it is. Okay. Someone else was saying some other emotes were missing, I think. I'm sure there's a few people who are listening who are like, this sound is so annoying, can you please stop? So, those of you, y'all people are gonna have to find another stream. <laughs> okay, I'm kind of kidding. I, I won't do it anymore. I know there's probably someone who's feeling that way. back what the f <laughs> that's cool man one of the uh there is a person who may or may, may not do Super Metroid speedruns I follow who has a uh, channel point redemption that's like make gargly mouth, mouth like water noises into the mic or something. <laughs> that's. <laughs> and someone redeemed <laughs> Someone redeemed it and I like couldn't believe what was happening.
Oh, you scamming little green cloud. Okay. All right, all right, here we go. I did not think I was going to grab. Well, it's on me, dude. I don't know how to manip that shitty golden cloud, man. I don't know. Would it give too much away? I mean, I don't know. I guess I feel like it's up to you. I wish I could actually spawn at the Golden Cloud. Because then I could, like, actually have attempts at it. Oh my god. Oh, he's he's out of control. He's like Hooper Stink. Okay. Okay. I wonder if I understand that. Okay. He was on right side. Okay, so in other words, this is the wrong direction. Because I'm going left side. So oh, so that... Do I know how how 3D works? Okay, we just gotta go with this. Okay, good RNG. It's this way. Okay, sweet. <laughs> I... Oh, shit, son. Don't kill me. I'm just a lad. I'm just a lad. Don't do it. Get away. <laughs> okay. Oh. What? I, why did I do my headbutt? Okay. <laughs> oh my god. Wait, how many lives did I lose?
Was I losing a life like every hit? Oh, what the f I was like actually wondering if I soft locked. Oh, this is over. I'm GG. Oh, you cannot. Dash, you son of a... I'm gonna... I have some frog legs on the menu tonight. I can tell you all that. I'm actually doing way worse. I think I have another continue, though. Dash, you... Okay. <laughs> I'm, I'm getting frustrated because I see openings and I just can't even dash. Get away. Oh shit. How how could a frog beat someone with such serious boots? Like are y'all like am I being for real? Oh shit. Okay, I, I just got lucky. I baited so hard. How many hits though? Dash? Oh, I got some serious hits. I was not sure. All right. Oh my god, if I just don't get dashes, man, then I just lose. There's, there's three enemies. There is the enemy, and there is my dashing. Okay, so I guess there's only two enemies. <laughs> so I, I have to fight both the enemy and my dashing. All right, Zanian. Oh! I don't know if this boss knows that I that I went through Hurricane Katrina. Which means I'm not afraid of this hurricane shit. Oh she uh she aerialed me. Falcon knee. Am I dead? <laughs> I'm expecting anything to just kill me. I'm the Dark Queen. Wrong is better than right. Dark is stronger than light. Great, I hate you, Battletoads. I'm out of here. Okay, I'm like waiting for the scam. I'm. <laughs> okay, I definitely thought I was dead. Okay, GG, 3, 32, 26, 38 about. Oh my god, okay. I wonder if I had another continue. I don't know. And so the Dark Queen is defeated once again, retreating into the shadowy margins of the galaxy to recoup her losses. Until the next time. I think that was my last continue, right? Because I used one in the tower. And then I... Did I use two just now on that boss? Something like that. 
Okay. Only one on the Dark Queen? God, I don't know. Damn, well, okay, GG's, y'all. I was beginning to think it wouldn't happen before I move. <laughs> Damn, okay, well, I am going to end the stream. Thank you so much. Uh, great drinks for the gifted sub to Aoyama Buki-san. Um, so, uh, freaking GG, I actually beat Battletoads. I actually thought there was another level after the tower. I thought it was going to be the tower and then maybe like a small level and then the boss. So I was actually not expecting the boss after the tower. Okay, what toad did I just save? Was that the first player toad or was that a different toad? Is that that toad? Is that not first player toad? Okay, so I saved Pimple and the Princess. <laughs> Spaceship Vulture. <sighs> okay, I am very, very happy to have beaten it. Hell yeah. Um, I guess I don't really know even what I'm doing next. I guess it might be Ninja Gaiden. I guess we'll see. Thank you for the GGs, everyone, and Grape Drinks. Thank you for the gifty. Yo, thanks, man. I... You kept me through it, you gave me... <laughs> I wonder if I even would have been able to beat it without... ...the things you helped me with today, I don't know. Even just whacking that green cloud with a stick... ...and, uh... ...kind of, like, helping me with, uh, with the golden cloud. That stuff definitely helped. Okay, I'm looking up who to raid. Thank you, everyone, for hanging out. Sorry, I'm, like, kind of running very quickly here because, uh, it's freaking late. Oh, yeah, Buki song. What's up? Okay, we're gonna raid Sefi. Um, GG's, we finally beat it. I'll probably highlight this specific playthrough, I guess, because it's like, you know, because I actually beat it. Um, because then I'll have like my first kind of game over playthrough. No problem. Um, but yeah, so it was, it was fun. Um, we're raiding Sefi. It looks like he's doing uh, Super Metroid 100%. So please chill with Sefi. You mean both of our first playthroughs? Like our first finished playthrough? Do you have it highlighted? If you have it highlighted, that could be fun. God, mine's probably so much worse. <laughs> okay, this playthrough actually started bad, too. I got to the last level with, one, with no lives, I think. Okay, Zany, I'll let you get this trivia in. 